uh, we want to look at, OK, imagine we calculate an exact and optimal value for EOQ. Most companies uh, will not be able to use that exact value for practical reasons. OK, if I tell you order 105.48 units of a product every time, OK, that's too complicated. That that decimal part is hard, I guess. And some you some products cannot be broken down, right? Uh, they could only be ordered in integer values. And, and more likely, your supplier will tell you, I don't care about small numbers, just order in increments of 100, OK? 100, 200, 300. I can't do 145, OK? It's because practical reasons. So now you have a trouble here. Your optimal ordering quantity is not possible. So what do we do? We will choose a value that's closer to it and meets our supplier requirements, right? But do we go up or do we go down? Okay, that's the question we are answering here. And if you look at my calculations, uh, again, from the KCD key concept document, you have that formula on the top, which tells you what is the total, how does total relevant cost changes if you use a Q instead of Q star? And again, to remind you, Q star is the optimal Q that I've calculated. And just a simple Q is any value of Q that I chose. OK, it's, it could be different from the optimal. So if you use that formula to calculate example one, if you look at example one and two, um, example one, uh, well, both examples say that Q star or the EOQ value is 100. So the optimal value is 100. But assume that you want to order 50% more or 50% less. OK, we will test those. Is 50% more better or 50% less? If you just uh, replace the values and calculate, you will see 50% more uh, will add about 8% to our cost. But 50% less adds about 20% to our cost. So. Uh, definitely, you want to order more in this case, okay? And that's the true. Uh, that's true for all the cases in EOQ. If you go x numbers above, uh, just just reading this first line here. If you go x units above, it's less detrimental than going x units below the optimal value. And similar thing, I've just recalculated this for time. Similar thing happens with time, because. T and Q go hand in hand. When you order when you order big amounts, it also takes you longer to consume it. So they have they behave the same. Okay. Um, 